On Tuesday, the Russian Defense Minister warned that the United States is preparing a provocation in Ukraine using toxic substances. The commander of the radiological defense troops, Igor Krylov, claimed that former U.S. Ambassador John Sullivan predicted this in incident by falsely accusing Moscow troops of such attack. The senior official also confirmed that the train with chemical products had arrived in Kramatorsk. The cargo was followed by U.S.-made armored vehicles heading for the line of contact as well as the shipment from the west of 55,000 personnel protect, personal protective equipment, gas masks and individual chemical bags, among other equipment. Also in Russia, at a meeting with Federal Security Service senior officials, Russian President Vladimir Putin said the West has never hesitated to use extremists to its advantage and that it has always used any resource at hand against Moscow. Putin said that it is necessary to identify and to suppress those who try to divide Russian society using separatism, nationalism, and neo-Nazism. Moreover, Putin urged the Russian Federal Security Service to put a stop to the attempts to foster division within Russian society by targeting mostly youngsters in the Internet and social media.